what's up y'all I've just finished a long day of work and um, some relatively unknown reviewer has asked me to make this video uh, sorry hold on what, what what's that his name again Wako, 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 I'm just doing it because you begged me oh, to do this video. It's not, not, it's not as if anything. You wako understand? Jaco. Wako, Jacko, wako, flacco. Well, <laughs> wako. <laughs> I hope uh, you like this. Actually, no, I don't care. You know what? Goodbye. Goodbye. Watch the men's club, y'all, and also subscribe to the Wako's review. Mwah. Hey guys, my name is Damien Lebe, scriptwriter for the Men's Club, and um, I'm just going to this prince of a person that never wants to show the bad side of his princess, Jasmine, has asked me to do a video for him, just to be, pretend like I know him, like he knows Jasmine, and wants to marry her. Mm -hmm. But anyway, Trace, your review is absolutely one of the best that I watch and I absolutely love it. I actually subscribe to the channel, which all of you should do. And even though it is biased, please watch it. Eh? Just try for him, I beg. And he has another channel he's, he's struggling to push. Please, you push go there too and subscribe and help him make small money so that maybe he'll be able to afford Jasmine now that, you know, Amino seems not to want to. <laughs> Bye guys. Quick shout out to one of my favorite YouTube review channels, Wako's Review. You're doing great, man. I look forward to your reviews more than I look forward to the episodes sometimes, for real. You have a fan here, man. Keep it up. Peace. You are very steady, man. You're funny as hell. Keep up your weird and funny videos going. Thanks. The next up, man. Peace. Bye so, if you are a TMC fan and you haven't seen a Wacko's review, <laughs> you are missing out, okay? He has the funniest reviews on the men's club. So watch out for him on Instagram and YouTube, okay? Hi guys, welcome back to a Wacko's review. Today will be different. I actually don't need to hype myself because the wonderful humans that started this video already did that for me. But what I will tell you is I have a goal to change my computer and with a dollar a month you can support me at my Patreon. And think about it, think about this, quick mass. If 50 people gave me a dollar by 2024, I can buy the computer. <laughs> All links are below, like this video and roll the intro. I do my reviews on this channel is I take each character and I dissect them. I talk about things some people have not seen before like how Larry was pregnant in the whole episode. I know you guys did not notice it and trust me I not edit it. That is actually, is actually pregnant. It, it looks edited. But believe me, it's not. Let's start with Larry. Larry is someone that I have tackled constantly. The memes I have created with Larry will last forever. And by forever, I mean after this video ends because I know you will forget all I said at the end of the video. <laughs> yes, sir. So with how crazy the show has portrayed Larry, I was expecting him to at least have brain in the final episode. But sadly, Larry was the only one that had the most confused scenes. Like his friends were out here fighting demons, fighting monsters in their own segment. And he was the trying to get his baby mama back he went to meet her she said go i love you go you really want me to yes go get out from here get, get out get out and that's all he did for now actually but but that's all tayo is still feeling the effect of his bank account after tiara did what she did you know what she did i don't need to even be telling you guys at this point so in the bid for him to save face he goes to see tiara so he can tell her to give him his money <laughs> <laughs> I'm useless, I know, I'm useless, I'm sorry guys. Then he got the worst news in the world. The doctor said she has been discharged from the insane asylum and he was shocked that his debt all don't fled. That's English. No question, that is English. If you know better than me, why are you watching this video, eh? The doctor then said she's not even in this country, she's in Canada. And he was like, how did you know that she was in Canada? The doctor was like, that's the only place our people go to. Oh yeah, you're right, yeah, you're right. I was then exposed for being selfish and self-centered. And with those bad traits, it only explains why he wants to always maintain the friendship he has with people he has done the deal with. <laughs> 
and I am happy he was scolded on this his childish nature. But the bad part about this scolding is that it came from the worst person, Larry. See, eh, I rather take life lessons from Teletubbies. You know, you know what? I'm wrong. See, I rather take life lessons from Teletubbies after they have taken 50 grams of cocaine and they killed the yellow Teletubbies. I hated that guy, but I would rather take advice from them than take advice from this guy. When you think of the most loved characters in this show, you first think of Louis and Lola. Everyone loves their love. I hate it. To be honest, the best loved character in this show is me. I'm not even in this show. Lola went to meet Louis's mom and gave her the news about their play play marriage. And to Lola's wildest dreams, she did not know she made a big mistake. Like, I would rather talk to a wall underwater. And I know very well I would connect more with that wall than I would ever with this woman. Like, she's just so negative. She said what they want to do is useless. And Lola was like, Keep talking like that and you're gonna lose your son soon. The joke here is she has lost him a long time ago. Lola then gave Louis's mom her address and bounce. Bad news then struck, struck, striked. Um, the smart people watching this video, you guys should fill in the blanks in the comment section. <laughs> the sad part about this episode was when Louis went to see Lola, but she was bleeding. The next thing with Lola was a shocker to the viewer, so apparently Lola was pregnant and lost the baby while sleeping. And this is very tragic to see. Amino acid. <laughs> I'm funny. I am funny. If you do not know him, let me give you a brief summary about Amino. He is this guy. That's all you need to know. The episode continued with Amino still angry with Patrick and Amino thinking Patrick had a hand to do with his farm burning. He was so angry at this point that he almost beat him up. And after Amino left, the secretary came closer to Patrick and what Patrick said to her baffled me. I will have to bleep it but everything I say here is factually correct. Is correct. He said, shut the f up. You f***ing If I ever see you around here again, I will f***ing shoot you. Yes, he said that. See, eh, I don't make all these things up, I swear. But because Aminu's farm was on fire, this made Aminu's true color show. He was soft at first, wanting attention. And don't leave. Don't leave me. <laughs> Then he went through the denial stage. He lost all hope. I was happy. Yes, yes. <laughs> Then we all saw him show pure anger. Aminu at this point was planning to not just arrest Mohammed, but end him. Yes, a criminal record is what he needs. I've always said it. Cri be criminal record. Straight up. Straight up. I love how his friends told him that he should not commit a crime because of a multi-millionaire loss. Then we saw the final form of Aminu. His ego came in play. His ego was like, wait a minute, let me enter inside this match. I think I can change things up a little bit. Freaking lecture! Is that why you guys are here, really? Lecture me now? Do something stupid. I should not do something stupid. But Aminu, look. Don't put Aminu me, are you deaf? This is my vengeance and I will have it. Never where I want, whenever I want it. Get out! <laughs> Taking a short break on Aminu, his brother Patrick did something out of his character. Patrick showed compassion and begged his dad to give Aminu support. And his dad was like, hey, I'm rich. I'm not meant to show any emotional support. That's what poor fathers are for. <laughs> 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 I see Robbie said. Aminu's team then found Mohammed and he beat the hell out of him. And I don't blame him. This guy looks like he has a written sign on his head saying, hit me. So Aminu called Mohammed's dad and reported him. And the scary thing is that his dad would actually kill him because his dad doesn't like when people steal from him. Yes, sir. So at this point, Aminu got all his lost money back, got his friend back. What else does he need now? <laughs> I need to go take a shower. Right? Need... Let me bathe you. Nice one, TMC. Nice one. Yay. Everything is working fine for him. Yay. Then it was time for the play play wedding. They all danced happily as the people at the back owned and wow. Larry begged his 70th baby mama to be his mentor if she doesn't want to be his lover. <laughs> We've seen that kind of script somewhere before. <laughs> Kyle looks like he wants to be with her design now. Amino and his babe are happier. Hey, hey, hey. And the show should have ended here, but no, no. They still found a way to disrespect me. How will they add Jasmine? 
after the end credits. The disrespect I have seen in this show is so troubling. It's so troubling, it scares me. But what I found lovely was when Jasmine left the child for Amino. Take care of him. You better take care of him. That's why Jasmine. You know what? I'll give the show my own ending. Yeah, yeah, that, that'll be better. My own ending. Good, does it? Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Shout out to my Patreon, um, Annabeth Udo. I hope I pronounce your name well. Victoria Akapo. <laughs> I'm, I'm joking. Belema Iyo. What, why is everybody having the same name? What? And Iroko Critic. Thank you guys. I started this thing a while back and they have supported me since day one. So I appreciate you all. My goal is to have 50 people by next year. No, no, 2024. I'll buy that computer and everybody will play play games on it <laughs> thank you to everyone that sent in videos from the cast the crew i really appreciate it like i've been working on this thing for a very long time and i appreciate everybody that went out of their way question of the day should i be in the next season please please comment say prince should be in the next season and probably one person will see it maybe two people will see it thank you guys for watching thank you guys for listening we'll catch ourselves in the next one bye